Hello friends, Tony here. Now in this video I want to install MariaDB in our VPS server. Of course you can install MySQL or Postgres or what you like, but I prefer to use MariaDB. And I am here in the mariadb.org. Let's go to download. And of course let's open also the warp terminal. And I'm going to log in here, so SSH. So Tony and also we need to add the Fast phrase and hit enter. Okay. Now let's say sudo hostname ctl or we need to add a password. And of course, yeah, we have here the operating system is Ubuntu 22. So here now we are going to select the MariaDB server repositories, choose the distribution which is for Ubuntu 22. And I'm going to choose this because we have here 22.04 as you can see. And I'm going to choose 22.04, uh, select a version, and I'm going to choose the 11.2. Okay, the mirror, I'm going to choose this one. And now let's open the terminal here. And as I have told you many times, I'm going to say sudo up. Uh, update first okay and then let's copy the first uh, command here and I'm going to paste it right here then the second one and paste it here and also the last one Okay, okay, now uh, the key is imported, so we need to copy and paste the following into the file under the slash atc. So let's cd in the atc slash apt. Okay, and here if I say ls, we have here the sources list.d, okay. And I'm going to copy this one now and let's navigate in the solid cell so ls l. And as we can see, this is a directory because we have the d at here. So I'm going to cd in that sources. And then I'm going to say sudo vi and for example, mariadb.sources. So Maria db dot sources here hit enter I to be in the insert mode and then we need to copy this and paste it here escape colon wq clean and let's see the in our default home page and I'm going to say sudo up get update again and then install apt-get, install the MariaDB server. So I'm going to copy this and paste it here. Hit enter again, and now we are okay. Now we are installing our web server, our database, and our application server. Here we are installing all of them in one server, and that's it's okay, it's not a problem. There is no reason why you shouldn't do that, but if you are not going to have a lot of traffic, if you have a lot of traffic, uh, what I usually do, and I do this in a lot of cases, is uh, I actually have a different VPS for my database. So I install the database in a different VPS than I do for my web server or my application server in this, this one, for example. Okay, in this course, uh, we are just going to configure it as one machine. Now let's see if we have installed the MariaDB by, I'm going to clean first here and I'm going to say sudo uh, systemctl and not start the nginx but I'm going to say status for the MariaDB. And yeah, we have loaded active and we are okay. 
it's clean. So let's uh, switch to the super user or root user by saying sudo su hit enter. And now, as you can see, we are as a root user. And what I want to do here, I'm going to say mysql dash u root and hit enter. And as you can see, we are in MariaDB. Now I'm going to say gra grant old on star dot star to root at localhost and I'm going to say identify it by and I'm going to add the password here and the password is going to is going to be just password and hit enter okay now we are good now flash the privileges by saying flash privileges like this and semicolon hit enter okay now let's exit from the MariaDB and also exit from the root user we are in the code with Tony and let's see if we can access now the code, the MySQL by saying MySQL dash u root and also we need to add the password so dash p hit enter enter the password which is password in our case and with a hit enter and now we are in the MariaDB as you can see now let's create a database so we're going to create the database with the name Tony we're going to say create database Tony semicolon hit enter okay the database is created and let's say uh, grant all on Tony dot star to Tony at localhost identified by so identified by I'm going to say Tony here also okay hit enter you have an error in your CCL grant all on Tony at uh, dot star to Tony at localhost identified not nigh by yeah my mistake here saying by and Tony hit enter and now we are okay and let's quit from here so I'm going to say quit good and now let's see if we can access the Tony database by saying MySQL dash u Tony dash p for the password okay enter the password which is Tony in my case hit enter and now we are in the database so we can say uh, show databases for example semicolon and now we have the information schema and Tony database okay friends that's it uh, all about this video how we can install the MariaDB in our uh, VPS server and if you like such a videos don't forget to subscribe to my channel like the video share with your friends and see you in the next one all the best and thank you very much